Hey you guys, it's me Aunt Shelly and we're back for book number five, The Ice Cream King by Steve Metzger. I think that's how you pronounce his name. Gotta give him credit. We have a special guest listener with us today. Everybody say hi. Don't mind my messy room. To Mr. Bobo Kitty. Hi Bobo. Can you say hi to everybody? Yeah, can you say hi? Okay. Let's get started with our book. He was laying down a minute ago, but I think he got annoyed at me. The Ice Cream King. On a hot day in July, Teddy Jones saw something that stopped him right in his tracks. Look, Mom, he exclaimed. It's a brand new ice cream shop. Can we go in? Can we please? Sure, said Teddy's mom. The real chill is the name of the ice cream shop. Mm. Inside, Teddy looked at all the flavors on the big board. Can I have anything I want, he asked, just for me? Yes, said Teddy's mom. Anything you want, just for you. So they have, I know you guys aren't really going to be able to see because it's backwards, but on their flavors board, there's Teddy and his mom sitting. They have Moon Crater Crunch, Peanut Butter Party, Double Double Fudge Fudge, Raspberry Rocket, Cookie Dough Castle, and Marshmallow Mountain. Which one would you want? I think, I think I'd want Cookie Dough Castle. Sounds good. And on a warm day like today, sounds really good. As Teddy tried to decide, the server put a paper crown on his head and... Wow! That's awesome, Teddy thought. My mom said anything. Upon my th throne of ice cream cones, I am the ice cream king. Ice cream treats are all I see, and they're all just for me. So here he is on his ice cream throne. Inside my ice cream castle, I slide down chocolate halls. I pick out rainbow sprinkles from mint chip walls. I slip and slide down whipped cream lane, then climb up ice cream mountain. I splash and dance and spin around beneath my ice cream fountain. So there he is, and there's his ice cream fountain. I blast off in my spaceship up to the ice cream moon. I zoom past ice cream meteors. I'm glad I have my spoon. Do you guys hear Roxy? She's in the backyard. <laughs> She's barking at her friend dog. Aboard my silver sailboat, I sail an ice cream sea. I fish for nuts and cherries. They're all for me, me, me. Yum, yum. I want to be sitting where he is. My very own volcano shoots out vanilla fudge. Today's the ice cream festival, and I'm the only judge. I think there's something missing as I look around my throne. What do you think is missing, you guys? What don't you see in these pictures? Let's see. I'm all alone. I dance and slide on ice cream. I can even wear it, but it would be so much better with somebody to share it. Teddy took off his crown. It looks a little sad, huh? So, have you decided? Asked Teddy's mom. Yes, he said. Please give me a banana split with strawberry ice cream and chocolate ice cream and lots and lots of hot fudge and whipped cream and sprinkles 
and, 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 asked Teddy's mom, and, asked the server, and, Teddy said. What else do you think Teddy wants on his banana split with hot fudge and sprinkles and different kinds of ice cream? So what do you think he might want? Let's see. Two spoons. He's going to share it with his mom. Isn't that so sweet of him? Ta-da. We're done. This page makes me want mint chocolate chip ice cream now. I'm hungry. All right. Well, thanks for, again, for joining me for book number five. And I will see you either later or tomorrow for book number six. Um, yeah. Okay. So I love you guys and I hope you have a good evening or morning or nighttime, just depending on when you're reading it. So have either a good day, afternoon, evening, or good night. I love you guys. All right. Bye.